we're gonna investigate the crypt if we can upgrade our equipment here. And with so many people on the street, we might be able to listen to rumors and gather information. I just knew her as a delinquent, but now... I never imagined I'd run into you in Crossbell. And working at a department store, no less? You seem to have taken it pretty well, too. How'd all this happen? If you don't mind, I'd love to play against you whenever you're at the time. <laughs> I don't mind. Hey, no fair. So it's around here. Yuna, you don't need to hold back. We have some time, so you should go see your family. that business. That's no dead end. That's no dead end. The SSS is down there. I know they're down there. Where's the SSS? Who are you, kid? Uh, general store, first off. Hello there, Yuna. What brings you here? I thought you were in Erebonia. Did you come back after failing their entrance exam? No, I passed my exam, thank you very much. I'm just here for one of our field exercises. <laughs> alright, alright. Don't forget to let little Momo know you're here. Absolutely. Oh, you're that kind of general store. Okay. Not a problem. Look at little Momo. I think uh, Ryu and Armory are leaving soon. <laughs> They're my friends, so I want to say goodbye to them. Here I go! Very well. well. Now. It's my turn! <laughs> what if this was something that happened in real life? You're just talking with someone. You're like... You're just like, oh, I wonder where... If, like, uh... You know, like they said. What, what, what you know, know... What Momo know you're here. Like, she's talking to you now. It's like... Oh, uh, where's Yuna? Here I, Here go. I go! Let's go! My turn! Talks it's my like turn! That. If you saw that in real life, I'd just be like, what the fuck? Ah, welcome! Wait, Yuna, is that you? Hello! It is you! I should have known from that million mirror smile. Now, if only you just calm down a tad, then you'd certainly be a fine young woman. Sheesh, you sound like my mom. <laughs> Let me have my fun. I've known you since you were a baby. And these are your friends from school? Welcome to Tally's. We're popular with the locals. Shop with us anytime. Any friend of you is certainly a welcome customer of ours. I wouldn't say that I'm exactly your friend. This place is... What's wrong, Yuna? Oh, nothing. I mean, is it the mayor's office? Or is this... No, that can't be the SSS building. Unless they remove SSS from the freaking, you know, thing. Hmm. Well, this ain't Yuna's home, but it's an apartment to check out, nonetheless. A new family has moved in upstairs. My husband wants nothing more than to one-up them. All these years, and this is what he's turned into. And at this rate, his uh, splurging habit is going to get worse. Adios, help me. Why do you got both of your lambs sitting together like that? I just woke to the floor, he's got both his yellow and orange lamb just sitting next to each other. Who are these neighbors? Are they someone I know? I'm afraid not. Hey, kid. Nicola. Nicola! Nico uh, Daddy manages an entire department store. <laughs> He's a very important man. 
He's even had interviews in magazines and everything. We recently decided to remodel this apartment. I just couldn't stand how cheap it looked before. Ah, but now that I think of it, goodness, I should have bought the whole complex. Excuse me, ma'am, you can't exactly do that. Hello there. Hello, hello, I'm the Villa Raisins caretaker, Sammy. This is a luxury apartment complex fit for celebrities and the like. It goes without saying, I hope, but uh, don't stir up any trouble, please. Who do you take me for? I ain't gonna cause no trouble. I swear it, I'm just Reen Swarzer, baby. <laughs> what do you want? Okay. Oh, just a one. There you go. Nope, you don't want nothing to do with me. Hey, kids. Oh, hey, it's Yuna. Long time no see. You're right. Hey, Yuna. How's it going, you big old tomboy? Hey, Arnie. It's good to see you. As for you, Ryu, maybe I need to reintroduce you to my fist. <laughs> well. Ah, uh, no thanks. I'm good. But, you know, you really shouldn't threaten the Junior SSS with violence. The what now? The Junior SSS. We just patrol the city and stuff. Any info past that is top secret. I'm guessing this is their version of the special support section. Yeah, but it's not really something they should talk about in public. I totally get why you guys look up to the SSS, but you should be careful to stay out of danger. <laughs> Don't worry about us, we'll be fine. And you lost your toy, didn't you, pup? Here you go, have it back. Besides, we can't leave this uh, city to the military police. It's okay, we've been at this for a while now. Are you guys Yuna's friends? Please be careful of all the horrible cars on the roads here. Alright, let's check out this bakery. Like I said, I'll go get myself some bread. Oh, Yuna, long time no see. It's been about three years. You've really grown. Um, it isn't... It hasn't even been a whole year yet. Oscar, you're always bad at guesstimating. But, do you really think I've grown up? Yeah, it's not like they just let anybody into the police academy. <sighs> Oscar's handsome, but he's kind of oblivious. Huh? Is something wrong? I don't know what's going on, but... I'll take these. I just finished baking them. Thank you. Wow, they smell really good. Is it the new bread for this month? Oscar, are you sure we can have these? Yeah, consider it a homecoming gift. Plus, you're with people who share some kind of connection with them. Huh? He's probably talking about Randy and that other guy. <laughs> Get some this welcoming gift. We have tons of great bread, so please try them out. Onion bagel. So many dishes, so much good stuff. When can I get it? This store offers a new type of bread every month, and they're all winners every time. It's why I make a point of stopping by every time one comes out. She ain't bad looking either. Oh, you must be the Imperials who accepted my request, right? Wait, what are you doing here, Yuna? And what's with that m uh, matching uniform? You mean this Void costume? Well, a lot of stuff's happened in the past couple of months. Oh, do you know her, Yuna? We're from Thor's Branch Campus. We're here regarding your request. It's a pleasure to meet you. As for Yuna, she's part of our class. I see. I heard that you joined the military or something after you graduated from the police academy. Uh, <laughs> sorry for not telling you. But don't worry about it. I'm sure you've been through a lot. On the bright side, it looks like you've got good people all around you. You're Yuna's classmates then, right? Don't be too hard on her, okay? Yes, of course. Bennett, please, you're embarrassing me. <clears throat> anyway, about that request. Oh, sorry, you already read it, right? Yes, I do believe it was a culinary-based request. Something about revolutionizing the world of bread, right? Does it have anything to do with the pure bread contest? What is that? Right, I better explain to the others first. The bakery changes its menu every month. That's where the pure bread comes in. Oscar and I attempt 
com compete to see whose bread tastes better, and the winner gets on the menu. But Oscar has gotten so good that his bread seems to win every single time. I I've gotta beat him. That's my menu. So this time, I want to create bread that's not, that not even he can compete with. To do that, I'll need some especially unique ideas. I see, so it's inspiration you're looking for. Well, count us in. I'll do whatever it takes to help mortgages, mor mortgages, or whatever, or mortgages. Unique ideas, huh? I'd say we make some pretty unique dishes from time to time. Unique is one way to describe them. Yeah, one of our personal specialties should do just the trick. I think we got this. Looks like you're starting to figure things out. But I'm not sure just one idea will be good enough. You have a point. What should we do then? Um, well... I don't want to bother you all, so I was only going to ask for one, but... Honestly, I would like three. <laughs> don't worry about it, we'll bring them right away. Yes, this is our job, so it's no bother at all. Three unique dishes. One moment, please. Okay, thank you. So you just want me to make, like, three unique dishes? Wants to see interesting recipes to give her inspiration. Giving her three unique dishes should be good enough. So basically, what you're asking me to do is make... You want me to make three dishes, but they have to be... Like... Mmm, they have to be delicioso. I think I can do that. But could they be any dish? I think they can be any dish. I have no idea... No guide tells me about extra points around here. So, like, I have no idea what kind of extra points I could gain if I give that her a certain dish. Because no guide specifies this. I have only found one guy that only really gives me all the quests, and it doesn't really specify anything that would help you during this stuff. So, you know, there's that. Unless, wait a minute. See, the thing I haven't done here is I haven't exactly clicked on the name of the quest that I'm given here. So, like... Um, what the fuck just happened? I don't know how I just got to character profiles. Uh, either way, can I just... Okay. Oh. Oh, yes. Never mind, this guy is actually really cool, because all I had to do was click on the name and it would give you the information of what you need to do. Oh god, have I missed some things in some quests? I wonder if I've missed anything in a few quests, like I haven't done them correctly. Oof, that's a bit worrying if I've done the quests wrong, but I don't think I have, I think I've done quests quite correctly so far. But this one, definitely. So she wants seven unique dishes. Seven dishes. Oh, jeez. And this isn't even, like, towards the end or halfway through the game. Like, damn it, dude. Okay. Now... Shut up, Reed. Alrighty, alrighty. I, I get it, I get it. So she wants seven unique dishes. I'll have to think on that for a bit. If I can do anything. One of the things I should do is go back, look through the stores and stuff like that. I think, wait, West Street was basically the last area, right? There's nowhere else to go. Yeah, okay. So let's go investigate those stores that we were supposed to before I, you know, mess around with that stuff. I should go to the harbor first, since it's farther away. Alright. Noodle shop, right here. 
Ah, customers. Come on in, it's just the four of you. No, we're actually here to co to conduct an edit. Huh? You guys are handling that? I knew the Governor General's office was going to the had the security division add us, but I didn't expect to see a bunch of Imperial students. Yes, well, we've gotten involved because it is now part of our field exercises. I know it's a hassle, but we but we very much appreciate your cooperation. Well, if that's the case, then okay. Koki, bring the books. We should only need this year and this year's and last year's. <laughs> uh, whatever he's saying, because Winston got on, I can't tell. Oh, gotcha, coming right up. Okay, these are the sale numbers and estimated number of visitors from this year and last year. Excuse us while we go over these. Whoa! The sale number shot way up. Oh yeah, you know that big RF building in the business district? Well, even if you ignore them, a bunch of companies from all over the continent have opened up offices there. Daytime sales are up, but it's the night sales that have really gone, have really grown. So last year, I decided to take this boy you see here as my disciple to help me out. I see. I remember coming here a few times last year myself. That's right, I remember you. You came three times, I remember correctly. I'm glad to see that you have graduated. Ah, uh, I see. I believe I was on a different mission at the time. Oh, so you've been to Crossbell before. Wait, aren't you that famous? You fool, he's still a customer. Don't go treating him any differently. As noodle artisans, our job is to feed our customers, that's all. Yes, sir. <laughs> well, thanks for the cooperation. We'll be sure to stop by for lunch at some point. Hmm. Alright, next place is down here. The business association area. Check out the sexy nurse. You're well in there, Hen. Excuse me. Hey, don't say it like that. This is a proper medical intern's uniform. Lynn? And should I guess maybe Becky? Because what other candidates or whatever sounding girl uh, do I know? None. I can't believe it's been over half a year since we last met, though. Don't think I'll ever forget Vivi bubbling away after you said you were transferring schools. <laughs> it seems like she's found a job that suits her well, though. Oh, by the way, did you hear? Right now, in Crossbell? Hmm, it looks like a different person is manning the store from earlier. And that person looks familiar. Isn't that Vivi? We met her in St. Ark. You're right, she looks exactly like her, but... <laughs> what a coincidence. Huh, that a customer I spy? Uh, I'm sorry, I've just been standing here talking and... Long time no see, you two. Lind enrolled in medical university, right? I didn't expect I'd find you here too, Becky. Reen! Oh, so both of you graduated from Thor's main campus. And you must be Vivi's older twin sister. <laughs> nice to meet you both. Well, oh, why did I say both? There was no reason for both. What the fuck? Split an image of one another. Uh, yeah, split an image of one another. But also the pure opposite personality-wise. Kinda beat it. This one here doesn't even realize that she's a babe. Plus she's an easy target for teasing. Hey, Becky. It's surprising how many of your classmates aren't in the military, instructor. <laughs> That's nonsense. But I guess only about 40% of them ended up in the military. 
Aye, but maybe not anymore starting next year. That appears to be the case, or so I heard from Vivi. I heard you have to start your own company, Becky. But I didn't know you were in Crossbell. Well, you cannot find a place that's harder for Collins than in Crossbell is right now. This East Street here is pretty... Uh, particulars lined up wee booths, and the people are dead nice too. So I asked Chairman Rose to let me work here. <laughs> I see. Being around all these booths sure is great. Yes, it makes me want to eat and walk around. Oh, you know what, girl? Everything's set up perfectly to just that. Um, Reen, was there something important you all came here to do? Ah, that's right. Actually, Becky. Oh my. We a bit saddened, but I guess official work's always like that. Can I say I get it though, so I'll go grab the chairman. That should do. Thank you. Let's take a look. Wow, looks like your numbers are much better than last year. Yes, we've had less customers from Calvin, but truly from Alimonia have doubled, you see. And there have been more residents that renovated the downtown district. The downtown district. That's where we are. There's a district like that in Heimdall, but was that the one uh, here renovated too? Hmm, it's more like it was redeveloped. Well, there's more to it, but we don't need to concern ourselves with that for now. Then again, that's for the inspection team. The more information they have, the better it'll be for future cluster. Please do alert to them with care. Yes, understood. Thank you. All the right, Reen students. Best of luck to you. I pray you find success in your field exercises. Nice to see Becky and Wind again. Some of my favorite NPCs. Choco, uh, Wendy, there's something I want to ask you both. Well, an audit? Straight from the desk of the Governor General, no less. <sighs> Honestly, I don't know what to think about it either. Sorry about this. Would you mind helping us out as best you can? <sighs> Fine, I suppose a lot of crossbellions do work for the Governor General's office. Uh, Choco, can you ask the owner for the sales date? Sure, coming right up.
got this in the bag. It turned out great! Have a taste! to prepare something. <laughs> this turned out well. My favorite. Give it a try. Now, let's begin. A worthy meal indeed. Allow me to prepare something. <laughs> this turned out well. Initiate cooking mode. Please, give it a try. I got this in the bag. Mm-hmm, it's perfect. I hope it turns out well. <laughs> I love making this dish. Allow me to prepare something. I'm proud how this came out. <laughs> 